Hello everybody, Jesse Dexy here. Welcome to We Party You. Dance With Me features my favorite song in the, the, what? I don't know. Okay. I did the Wii Party playthrough for the Nintendo Wii and I thought I'd uh, possibly do the Wii Party U as well. However, there is less to do as the single player, so this is probably not going to be as thorough as Wii Party is. So, we see here there's one to four for four of the five uh, modes in TV Party. Gamepad Island is, uh, for some reason, two players, two to four. I would love to do that as a single player, but apparently I can't. So, I gotta do the other four. Uh, house Party, I think, is, yep, two or three or four. Can't do any of those. Gamepad Party, I, I can do some of these. Five of the se uh, seven. Okay, so I'll get to those as well. Um, and we can also do the mini games as well. There's one here for two to four, so I can't do that. One of you did tell me about Dojo Domination. We'll do that at some point, but uh, oh, there's what? Bridge, bridge burners two to four. Wow. Okay. All right. I guess we'll get started with Highway Rollers and see what we can do from here. Playing time approximately 45 minutes, so uh, you don't mind these videos being a little long. And if they are about an hour, I'll just split it into two parts. Throw your dice in the air and make a run down the highway and highway rollers. In this board game, how high you place in a minigame determines the number of dice you get to roll. So, basically Game Pie Island, but on a highway of some sort. Alright, we got Mark, Jose, and Gina? Hmm, interesting. Alright, we'll go to Advanced. Uh, alright, Marius, Masako, and Anne. Alright, we'll go with that. And I got the gamepad, Wii U gamepad with me, because apparently you need that as well in this game. Because why not? Why wouldn't the game take advantage of... The gamepad. Okay. Yeah, how about that? Quite a lengthy highway, to say the least. It would not be as fun to drive a car through this. Welcome to Highway Rollers. Do you want to hear the rules? Well, it's been a long time, so maybe. This game mainly uses remote controllers. The gamepad could be used as well, depending on the situation. In Highway Rollers, you get to throw a bunch of dice to move forward along a zigzag highway above the water. The first player to reach the goal is the champion. All players will compete in a minigame at the start of every round. The number of dice you get to roll to move ahead all depends on how you place in the minigame. Alright, so even though this is a long one, you get more dice. So like in Mario Party 10, you get up to 5 dice or something. In here you have uh, up to around 5 to 7, I don't know how many, but yeah. May the best player win. Alright, round 1, play for order. Okay. Alright, what minigames shall we have here? Another shooting game, but in space. UFO spotted. The player who manages to zap the most aliens wins the game. A UFO with one alien is one point, and with one with three aliens is three points. So, point and shoot with A. Your lasers are low tech, so forget about rapid fire. You'll have to zap these UFOs one at a time. Of course we do. Make sure there are no people or whatever. I'm the only one here. The only thing that can get in my way is the microphone and the big long box right beside me. So. Okay, let's do this. Really? Oh, come on, let me have some. Alright, I got two of them now. Alright, 
It takes a little bit for the uh, oh, I, 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 mine, mine, mine. It takes a little bit for the uh, the gun to recharge and shoot. So, oh, that was not bad. A little rapid fire there. Can I get another three? Yep. I, 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 I. Oh. Oh wow. Eighteen seven six five. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Seven six five. That equals eighteen. So <laughs> mathematically, we're right. <laughs> oh boy. Eighteen minus seven is eleven. Minus six is five. Minus five. wow. All right. Good job, everyone. Beamer fifteen will go first. Mel your second. It's the same order, basically. All right. What do we got here? Three hundred. Oh my lord. Ten. Wow. Okay, we're gonna speed through this apparently. Roll ten dice. Uh, okay, up to sixty spaces. My God. Ah, yeah. Woof. So I'm sad there that I didn't get uh, more than half of the uh, the wall, huh? Seven dice for second place. That's interesting. And then I'm guessing five for third place and then three for fourth? You didn't get nearly as many as me. 21, not bad. Masako! Four dice, okay. And then two for fourth place then. Kinda sucks. Oh wow, you got a good one there. 19. Whew. Plus five spaces. Oh my. Oh, you get to roll five and move ahead. Okay. You lucky. What kind of roll is that? Oh, you almost got a straight. So you almost got one, two, three, four, five. Oh, how dare you pass me? Oh well. At least she doesn't get to use the plus 20 spaces though. Two dice, alright. And you need to catch up, girl. You're way far behind. Six. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, plus 10 spaces. That's good. Pow! So off. All right. Next mini game. What do we? What is it gonna be? Another cut racing game. Hmm. Steal the remote. Oh, RC drifters. Steal the remote controlled cars through the moving gate to score points. I see. You get one point for going through, but you'll lose one if you go through the gate in the wrong direction. Well, as long as you go in a circle, you, you should have no problem. Uh, yeah. Alright. Cool, cool. Oh, we're not even driving the cars, we're... We're controlling it. <laughs> What? Hello? There we go. Well, this is pretty easy, to say the least. Finish. Wow. They went in big circles, but... When you're the human player, you can just do smaller circles and get more points. Wow. Alright. Is it going to be the same order or is it Oh wow, different. Anne is still in last. Oh my. She's having bad luck today, wow. <sighs> oh, wow. Alright. 
Let's go. Um, I already did that on the first turn, dude. Sick the remote to do to do that, and boom. Let's get a lot of sixes. We got three of them. More than thirty. Yep. Oh wow, nice. We still have a long way to go, though. It takes 45 minutes, so we're going to be here for a little while. Even if we get 60 every turn, it's still going to take some time to get there. 24. hi yi yi Ow. Oh, you were supposed to land on the minus 10. But no, we got to do another battle for some reason. If you win, you'll get five dice. If my team wins, they get to roll two dice. Okay. Masako, please switch to the gamepad. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. She uses the gamepad, but for us, we use the re re remote. The gamepad player hides the diamonds within, within the treasure boxes, and then the gamepad player must safely hide at least one of the diamonds to win the game. So we, so the team of three has to find all three diamonds. That makes sense. All right, this makes sense. The one player might have a bit better of a chance to uh, with five diamonds, but I think that may not be uh, fair to the team of three. So three chances. Okay. What what do you guys think? Hmm. Nothing. Well, he found one, and she found one. Where's the other one? Up there, of course it is. Oh, round two. Oh, there's three rounds, or two? Oh, okay. Well, I I don't think she's gonna hide it in the big chest, but. She could hide it there just on the off chance. I'm tempted to pick it, but I don't know. Alright. Of course he didn't do that. Oh. Oh. Alright. Final round. Okay. There's another big one. Okay, I'm gonna pick a small chest this time. Alright, I'm gonna go here. Oh, sir. Ow. Yay! Hey, <laughs> we found it. Good job, dude. Finish. Although I wanted to find a diamond. Because you, you two found one. I'm basically diamondless. <laughs> oh, well. Alright, two dice. Let's go. Nine. Beautiful. Oh, I don't get to do that. Not fair. Alright. And because he and Anne haven't gone yet, they'll get to move before we do another minigame. Although... And needs needs to catch up. He is right behind the uh, Marius, though, so she's not that far. But she's way behind me and Masako. Ooh, fourteen. Oh. Okay. Are you gonna land on one of those twenty spaces, or? Yeah, you are. Okay. So you're gonna get ahead of Marius right now. Nice! Pow! Nice. Good going, Anne. Round three. Ooh. Cage Chomp. 
be the first player to escape from the giant chopping fish. Rox watched the cards as they were being shuffled and then tried to pick a plus card to move up towards safety. The first player to grab a card gets to use it. Hmm. Alright. Wow. He does not look friendly. Although that could be Lord Wu Fakbak in uh, robotic form or something, I don't know. <laughs> nah. Oh yeah, it can be because he's got the... It's an angler first. Plus two for me! Ah, oh, Marius, you're done. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, now they get plus two. <laughs> wow. Oh, Marius is done. He's gonna get eaten. Oh, Masako. Oh, poor you. Oh. oh. And they're dead. Oh, no, they're not. They got... Okay, then. All right. Plus two for me? Dang it! Finish. And, and one. I'm close. I should have picked the one on the left. That would have been good. But, no. Oh, well. I got second, at least. But this, this gives Anne a chance to catch up to me, which I probably don't want. And Masako got last. Wow. So sad. Alright. Don't catch up to me, okay? I'll throw your, I'll throw your ass into the water if you <laughs> catch up to me. Oh wow, that's a big number there. Oh boy. Yep, she passed me alright. What is that? Last place boost. Oh wow. Melius is gonna get a boost. Get to move the same number of spaces? If the, U if the UFO comes up on the wall, you can warp over the end space. Not nope, 10 spaces. Pow! Okay then. Alright, well, she's just up there, so she didn't get past me so far. Um, we still have a, quite a ways to go, my god. Alright, let's go. Ah, bam! Big number, come on. Whole lot of sixes. Well, decent enough. Not bad. Woo! Oh, UFO. Surprise time. Don't take me back. Roll the die and move to that place. What? I don't want to move to... M. M. Thank you. Didn't go back that far, but still, I didn't want to go back at all. Wow. I guess it's good that my, uh, I guess it's good that Anne did pass me, so I didn't have to go back so far. Oh wow, that sucks. Masako got a better number on four dice than you. My god. Six. Although I would have laughed if you got two ones. That would have been funny. <laughs> okay. Ooh. We're dealing with suits. Select a uh, heart target. Select only the heart shapes from the notebook. You'll lose points if you get any of, of the other uh, suits. 
The player with the most points after five rounds wins. Oh boy. All right, hearts are red. And they're obviously in the shape of a heart. So let's do this. Oh, okay. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Oh, you stole that from me. <laughs> I hit the spade and lost the point. Oh my god. Oh well. And. And got last place three times. And won first place one time. That's, that's ridiculous. Alright. Come on. Yeah. One of these days, I'm gonna get all sixes. That would be awesome. But no. That is a good one, though. That's a good roll. I got 37 again. My god. Alright, what is this? Challenge. You can only move ahead if you roll 1, 3, or 5, so odd numbers. Alright. Come on! Boom! Odd number. Odd number. Dang it! Well, I, I'm stuck here. What in the hell? Well, I don't get to do the rest of my roll then. Move back one! Oh, you suck. That is a lot of bullcrap. Come on. If Anne goes past me and um, successfully does the challenge, then I'm gonna kick a butt. Last place boost. That will be Masako this time. And she's not even that far behind either. Twenty. Oh wow! You allowed her to go past you. Whoa! Oh, by one space. <laughs> I didn't think she was that far, but yeah. Okay. They apparently caught up to us. So not cool. She's not gonna reach the challenge with that though. Boys, nope. Wow, you almost got the surprise base. Okay. Be a pal and don't reach me. Oh my god. Seriously? You know what would be good? If you went back to Marius' space. That would be cool. What I tell you? Go back. Go back, go back, go back. Go back to where you were. Alright, round five. We're probably gonna reach round ten after wait. This reminds me of the minigame of uh, Toad House minigame in Super Mario Bros. 3. I think it's th three anyway. Yeah, match me. Match the spinning middle part of the faces to the top and bottom parts of the faces. The player with to correctly line up three faces first wins. All right. So this is more timing based than anything. Oh wow! I already I already win because that's my face. <laughs> All right. Whoa, damn it! Really? Really? Oh wow. Oh what? That wasn't the right face? Oh you suck.
Seriously? My god. That is a lot of crap. You guys cheated. And Masako wins for the first time in years. Good job. Wow. <laughs> I think I'd probably prefer the minigame in Mario Bros. 3 over that. <laughs> yes, it's because I lost, okay? <laughs> oh, wow. Good roll. Well, decent at least. Oh, well, good roll. You tied me. But you don't get to go past the bridge, okay? That is mine. That is my challenge to win. Oh, you suck. <sighs> Lucky. All right. How about you get a very, very low roll, dude? That is not a low roll. I hate you. And he gets to pass me, of all people. And might not be able to get past me, but she still could. Yep, she's got past me as well. Wow. Everyone is not so nice all of a sudden. Really? Okay. I gotta win this one. What do we get this time? Another UFO game? Really? UFO Zap Up. The game player... The, 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 the game player pad? What? The gamepad player flies the UFO and tries to zap up the rival players. The gamepad player wins if all the rival players get zapped up. Alright. We're just running away, away, away. Alright, I got master dodging skills, so let's go. Oh, you can move back as well. No, 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 no. You're not gonna catch me. Go after Masako. Come on, uh, Masako. Go, go away. Go, do, go. No, no, no. Oh, you suck. Keep going, Masako. Come, no, no, no. Come, 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 come. Oh, you suck. Where to go? You and your platinum suit can go suck it. <laughs> she gets to roll five dice. No fail. No fail at all. Now I'm probably gonna land on the one versus three and... I gotta win... if I do. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Hmm. Okay. Big number seven. Alright, lucky seven. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh, plus ten. Whee! Alright. I was kind of hoping to do the one player, uh, one versus three so I can get five dice and roll, but. Oh well. Ooh, pole bolt. Me bolters. Bolt, bolt yourself off of the long pole and into the air to see which player can land the farthest from the start. The key to going far is running fast and knowing just when to release the pole to fly through the air. Oh boy. Hold the root no, shake moat fast, plant the pole on the ground and press A to launch yourself from a chosen angle. Like are you beginning? Mm, okay. Okay. We got this. I so got this. Are you gonna make me go first? Start. 
Yep. Yeah! Come on, come on! Let's make it to 200! Nope. Ow! You couldn't go one more yard to make it even? Come on! That'd go bunch of baloney. Oh, wow. You didn't do as well there. I'd say 150 for advanced computer player would be pretty decent. And Marius failed that, so he sucks. And Masako sucks as well. Oh well. And are you gonna surprise me or are you gonna fail just like the others? Wow, she got past them. Good job. Finish. And I beat the record too. I, I didn't even notice what the record was. I just barely beat it. New I know, by four yards. Mm. All right. Okay, now I get to catch up to Masako. Which she only 18 spaces ahead of me. Okay. Yeah. All right, get big numbers, big numbers, big numbers. Yes. One little two, but oh wow, forty-five, nice. Woo! Oh, that is lovely. Try and beat that. That's seven dies, so seven times six would be 42. So even if she got all sixes, she wouldn't be able to beat me in terms of the roll. And she once again plays a one versus three minigame as the lone player because why the hell not? Zigzag lot. Rival players must avoid heavy blocks being dropped from above by the gamepad player. The gamepad player wins by knocking out all the rivals within the time limit. Zag away. Alrighty then. Another avoiding minigame. I am the master dodger and I'm gonna prove it by winning this minigame. It'd be helpful though if I had the master dodge badge from Paper Mario though. You don't get to squash me, punk. Oh wow, Masako almost ran into that one. Oh wow. Finish. All of us survived. That was easier than the UFO one. Hmm. Cool. So all of us get, well, except her, but we get to use two dice blocks. Alright, I get to go further ahead. Nine, nice. I would have kicked someone in butt if I only got a two. 